what's good beautiful people thanks for clicking on this video welcome and welcome back to this channel i got a real short video for y'all today i got a question about whether i like to diffuse or air dry or sit under the hooded dryer honestly i do all three and honestly i don't have a preference and i never really thought about it until somebody asked me and i was like you know what let me actually pay attention to what I like better and that's what we're going to answer today. This is my beloved hooded dryer that has not let me down yet. <laughs> Hopefully not anytime soon either, but I've had it for a couple of years. I wanna say two, three years. It is by Kiss. It's called the Red 1875 Watt Ceramic Something Hooded Dryer. Of course, I'm gonna have a link for y'all. And of course it is in my Amazon storefront. It's $51, I think it's worth every penny there is a way to extend it but i have no idea how so i just prop it up on this macbook box because you know nobody throws away apple boxes anyways so might as well put it to some use honestly you could put it anywhere i wanted this type of hair dryer because i don't have much room to put one with a stand and i love to keep the box because it fits right there in my closet i think it's the perfect size anyways on to answering this question must be a short answer because it's a short video truly honestly i don't have a preference even after really analyzing okay does does my hair look better does it feel better i don't know really i feel like the determining factor is how you apply these products and let me tell you my hair was looking so bomb before drying it and i used the same wash and go combo that i did in my how do i get my shape video and in that video i diffused my hair and this is the next week so i can really compare the two and i wanted to use the same products because i wanted it to be an even playing field and i honestly really could not tell a difference yeah that's my answer <laughs> i don't have a preference there is a lot of conversation about oh don't air dry or sitting under a hooded dryer can be less frizz and maybe that is the case there could be a slight difference but so slight that i cannot tell my hair looks just as shiny just as defined as it did in the video where i diffused my hair i had the same definition throughout the week i had the same amount of frizz throughout the week i did sit under the hooded dryer for an hour and when i'm done under the hooded dryer i stretch my hair just as i were to do if i diffuse it so the routine is not much difference the only difference really do you want to sit and have your hand with a hair dryer do it that way or do you just want to sit under a hooded dryer and be on your phone that's really the only difference to me but bottom line it's a preference if you feel like one thing works better for you then do that thing i feel like what really determines which your wash and go gonna look like is how you are applying those products and not to say that how you dry your hair can mess up your wash and goes because that can happen that's why you should watch my last video if you haven't how i dry my hair properly with creating the less amount of frizz but what i am saying is you can go about it however you want to just be careful how you're doing it truly and really that's all that's it um how do you feel about it let me know your thoughts also keep the questions coming keep the comments coming i have a really really good video for y'all next week make sure you are subscribed and it's going to be way longer than this one i promise until next time i'll see y'all later deuces